hello guys welcome to our channel and today we will discuss a very simple example of how can we give grades with the help of VLOOKUP function and this is a very simple example so we'll start our example without wasting any time first I just select the uh, boxes and write here uh, calculate the grades with VLOOKUP and I just make it center alignment and make it bold now here I just write the name and the name of the subjects like maths science computer and the last one is English and here I'll write the total marks and here uh, I write the uh, percentage and again in the last I write the grades for giving the uh, name I just write about Harry Mark James and the last John now I just now I just need to uh, write the uh, marks and for giving the mask is it's up to you you can write manually or I just use the write button function so uh, how I just use I just read R in RAND B E T W W and RAND between bracket and in RAND between says the bottom and the top which means the minimum marks and uh, so I don't write 70 and for maximum marks I write 100 for making making it more practical mm, here it gives the marks I just drag it down and again drag it to the, the all subjects so the all marks uh, are put it in it but there's in confusion or there's one uh, issue in rand between functions like if I just select any cell so it will changes the values and you can see the values are continuously changing so to make it constant you just need to select all the values and here you see the copy option you just copy the values and again select the uh, whole address and here it gives you the another option which is paste values so I just click on it the paste values and if I uh, double click on any cell the values remains constant this is how you can make the values constant now it says total marks so for giving the total marks we just use the uh, sum function so I just write equals to assume sum bracket open and now I just select the uh, address of all the subjects and just uh, total it and it gives you the total marks and I just drag it down so in this way it gives you a uh, total marks and for getting the percentage uh, for percentage we just uh, make a manual a formula like equals to bracket open and you give the address of the marks which will which is caught by the students divide by the total marks and here we have four subjects so I just make the total of 400 and close the bracket and static static means multiply by 100 now it gives you the uh, percentage I just drag it down so here it gives you the value so if uh, you want in decimal so you can increase the decimal or decrease the decimal this is up to you now it says grades so far before giving the grades I just make it more presentable so how I just make I just write all border functions and again I just write tick and here I write a uh, yellow color make it more attractive and make it in center alignment and make it bold and in bold and again I color it and make it in yellow color and now here I just write the criteria criteria and grades so for criteria if the person got zero marks then it will give false if cars uh, more than 60 so it will be given the grade D if got more than 70 it will be given the grade C on 80 will be given the grade B and if 90 and greater than it will be given grade A now I just uh, select and again select here giving the grade and color it so our this criteria is completed 
our all thing done now just you need to put the crates and for getting the gears you just use the vlookup functions so how i just use the vlookup function i just run equals to we look up bracket open we look up bracket open now it says which value i look up so i just select the address of the cell which means you just need to look up the g5 address now it says table array from which i extract the data so i just select the whole table array and now it says which column value i give to you so i, I just need the column value of 2 which is the grade and the last which is very important it says true and false if i just write 0 so it gives the exact value which means if the uh, person got 0 so it gives f mm, and if person uh, got 1 so it says nothing available because there is nothing uh, one is not written here so for true it gives the exact value and if i just write 0 or write a 1 so for 1 means false so it will make a range which means if the person got uh, greater than or less than um, greater than 0 or less than five, uh, 59 so it gives f for uh, using our 1 so i just use the 1 and close the bracket here it gives pre-create because the person got uh, more than 70 and less uh, the person got more than 80 and less than 90 so this is how it set the grades and you just need to drag it down and this is how you uh, got the grid and here you see the grades are B because uh, the person is actually got almost all person got 80 grades uh, to uh, ac practice or to test our formula you just need to increase the marks of the students and I again my increase the marks of this student and here you can see this person got the A grade and if I just uh, decrease the marks of that students so here you can see the person got C grades this is how you can make the grade function uh, with the help of VLOOKUP function this is very easy and if you face any confusion you can write in our comment section thank you for watching our whole video